New details this morning at a Target 12 investigators exclusive selling your secrets. We reveal just how easy it is for companies to get their hands on your private and even embarrassing health information. These companies make millions collecting and selling the details of our personal lives. And we've learned they don't just stop with your medical history. They're selling nearly every piece of information they can get. Target 12 investigator Walt Pateau has more on what he's uncovered. Target 12 bought a list of 5,000 New Englanders who suffer from seasonal allergies. But we also found out some of the lists get much more personal than who is sneezing during allergy season. They're called data brokers, companies that make millions gathering and selling our personal information. The data is either public or offered willingly. When we fill out online surveys, post information on social media about a health problem, or use a rewards card to buy medication, we're feeding the data collection machine. In some cases it's legitimate, in other cases it's deceptive, in other cases uh, it is merely misleading. I would not say, unfortunately, that it's prohibited by law. The list we bought involved something not very embarrassing. Allergy sufferers like Frank and Cranston. Can you imagine if it was about something medical that was embarrassing? Yeah, really. I was, I was shocked when I was told. But with a credit card and a few clicks of the mouse, a sea of personal details was at our fingertips. You can buy a list of people in high income brackets, a list of gamblers, lists based on marital status and hobbies. But some of your most personal information is collected on health lists for bladder conditions, depression, cancer, and more. Experts tell us there are a few things that could protect some of your personal information. Use a nickname when you sign up for a rewards card. Be careful what you post on social media. And remember, your credit card purchase information is for sale. Data brokers say they're self-regulated and dedicated to ethical use of your information. The Senate did study this issue recently, but right now there are no plans to add any regulation to this multi-billion dollar industry. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News. Head to our website to learn what you can do to keep your personal information from being gathered by these data brokers. You'll also learn how to find out if you're on one of these lists and what you can do to get your name removed. It's all online right now at WPRI.com. More coverage you can catch.